Hi everyone, here's a video just explaining the collections feature in Destiny Discover, our online catalogue. So this is the front-facing interface that all the Grade 4 students will have saved as a button on their home screen on their iPads. It's going to bring them straight here. Um, this is where they can search for books. I also have some links here. Um, but if you scroll down, I have collections. And actually the first one here is... Um, grade 4 is UOI collection on energy. So if we click on there, um, you can see all the resources that I have um, collated for your UOI. So most of these are um, online resources. There's web pages, um, some videos and ebooks from Epic, and from some. Um, databases and um, some articles from databases and Newzella and things like that um, so and here are some books this was from last year's UOI as well um, so I would love it if um, you guys would also like to collaborate on it I have sent you all an email asking you to join this collection and um, you just have to sign in and then accept the invitation um, your sign in is at the top right hand corner. It will ask you to log in. Um, it will be your first name dot last name, same as your school Gmail, and then the password will either be your school Gmail password if we reset it last year, or it will be your um, ID code, which is on your um, school ID card. Um, if it's not any of those things, come and see me in the library and we can reset your password for that. Um, but once you have got that, you can literally um, add any URL into this collection. You just um, press this plus button here in the bottom right corner. And so any website or link that you find anywhere on the internet, you can add. You can also search here in the search bar. So if we search energy, um, then it shows you books that we have in the library but not only books it also will show you uh, websites and these are all um, kind of safe search websites and reliable sources and we can just add those into the collection here by pressing add to collection um, and databases sometimes it's a little slow to load um, and other resources there as well. So I think this is a really great tool um, to use especially when the kids are virtual because all teachers can add to it. We can use it year after year um, and they can access it really easily from home with this um, interface that they're already quite familiar with. So um, that's it. If you have any questions just come and find me in the library.